Hi, this is Tammy Powley, and one of my favorite hobbies is making beaded jewelry. In this video, I show you how to use a bead board so that you can also create your own beautiful beaded jewelry designs. Bead boards come in different configurations, sizes, and finishes. Most often, they are either made of plastic or they will have a flocked finish over the plastic. The basic bead board will have one grooved area for making single strand jewelry pieces. The extra slots allow you to store beads and other materials while you're working. However, you can also find bead boards configured to allow you to design multiple strand jewelry pieces. No matter what type of board you use, all of them include incremental markings, one inch and half inch. These marks are helpful for determining the length of the finished piece. The center mark is a zero, and then the increments expand, one, two, three, and so on. So if you want to make a 20 inch necklace, your beads would need to fill the groove until the 10 inch marks on either side of the board. To design on a bead board, place your beads in the groove and start to move them around until you find a pattern that you like. Once you have determined the pattern, arrange the beads so that you have the length you desire. Remember to also include the length of the clasp when you're trying to figure out the finished length of your jewelry piece. At this point, you may be ready to string your beaded design, but what if you aren't 100% satisfied with the design? In that case, set your bead board aside and come back to it at a later date with a fresh eye. When you come back and look at your bead board later, you may decide to make a few changes. In fact, this is one reason why it is a good idea to have a few bead boards around. This way, you can let one sit and still continue to make more jewelry. I hope you found that helpful, and if you have any comments or questions, feel free to post them in the comments below. Make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel, and of course, have a wonderful crafting day.